fellow adventurers, welcome to my in-depth guide on mastering the Guardian Druid Mage Tower Challenge in WoW Dragonflight. First, let's dive into talents. You'll find our recommended talent build below, and I've also added it in the video description. If you're looking to gain an advantage, I've put together a list of the most effective consumables to use. Let's jump into the first phase of the challenge, where you'll face Inquisitor Varus. To counter his Aura of Decay, switch to Moonkin form and use your ranged DPS. Varus also uses Mind Rend for minor damage and drain life, which you need to interrupt to stop him from healing. When Nether Horrors show up, use Incapacitating Roar to disrupt their spells and Bark Skin to draw their attention away from Velen, hitting each with Moonfire. Also, for the eyes that spawn, ensure you face them directly and take them out with Moonfire. If you want to skip the long Mage Tower grind, check out ConquestCapped.com. They're top rated on Trustpilot for boosting services. They can finish Mage Tower challenges for any class in about 15 minutes, safely and without accessing your account. They're super quick. For more info, click the link below and use my special code POISYYT to get an extra 10% off. As this phase progresses, Inquisitor Varus calls forth Smoldering Infernals. Dodge their attacks using Skull Bash or Wild Charge as they can knock you off the platform. Remember, Infernals resurrect continually, so keep your focus on Varus while continuously applying Moonfire to them. Next, we move on to the second phase where rapid significant damage output is crucial. Use your most powerful damage abilities, potions, and drums during this segment. If executed well, this phase should be quick, lasting about a minute. Be aware that mobs from the first phase will keep appearing, so you'll need to manage them while also battling Cruel. Cruel attacks mainly with Annihilate, Nether Stomp, and Twisted Reflection. Annihilate's damage increases with each hit, but with the right defensive moves, you can withstand 3 to 5 stacks. Quickly move out of the way of Nether Stomp's fiery trail. It's vital to interrupt Twisted Reflection with Skull Bash to stop Cruel's significant healing. That's everything you need to know. Follow these strategies and you'll conquer the challenge. If you're aiming for the coveted werebear form with minimal effort, Conquest Capped is your best bet. Check the link in the description. Good luck and enjoy the challenge. See you next time.